Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're doing gameplay with the brand new Amethyst Andre Kirilenko. This card is so interesting to me because he's a 6-9 lock. I think this might be the best pure lock in my team. Does that mean he is the best small forward? No, I think Car Car I think uh, KD is better, and honestly, probably Kawhi, though we'll have to see on the release. Um, but I think AK in terms of just pure defense at the small forward to power forward position is as good as it's going to get because he's got really good size. The stats and batters are incredible. And I think offensively he's going to be good as well. He's got the ability to ball handle some as well. I think I think he's going to be a legitimately versatile, really good card. Before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Help me push towards the 15,000 subscriber mark on the channel. I'm uploading every single day. Tons and tons of my team content. Would really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe. Without further ado, let's hop right into it. Take a look at AK47. So 86 offense, 98 defense, 6 foot 9. Going to be playing with small forward in today's video 86 driving layup 88 midi 86 three ball uh dunking wise not amazing uh, i did boost his three ball and his ball handle rating as well as a couple other boosts you are seeing all these are plus four boosts this is the only addition that i made to this ak card but i did put the shoe on him mainly because i wanted to get the ball handle to an 86 so that i could time and burst with him so ball handle shoe is important on this card also 91 block now 92 steals 88 93 perimeter and now 91 interior it was an 87 really solid rebounder so he can play power forward just fine 87 speed with the shoe so 83 speed to ball 86 or 76 lateral sorry 76 acceleration and a 93 lateral quickness he's going to be incredible defensively three hoffs are clamps glove and right stick ripper which is one of the best hoff badges in the game 14 goals include break starter challenger chase artist interceptor off ball pass pick dodger post lockdown pogo stick work cross scooper spin cycle two step big driver and physical handles uh 17 silvers include acrobat pro touch slithery dimer handles for today's hyperdrive killer combos needle threader post playmaker special delivery he even has anchor on silver ankle braces brick wall relay passer touch passer fast feet 94 feet he is probably in my opinion the new best defensive card in my team on the perimeter because of a combination of defensive animations size and his defensive stats and badges the fact he's got anchor very high interior and perimeter as well is so useful and then with the time with this ball handle shoe he can now time and burst which is something that he wouldn't have been able to do before is he the greatest playmaker in the world no is he actually a legitimately versatile secondary or tertiary playmaker 100 percent he is which is really really nice to have like even more than Kawhi would give you in terms of playmaking ak will give you so that i'm a huge fan of the release is fine it's that base 29 from previous years drew holiday danny granger type release it's a very common release ak's had this multiple times in the past i think last year this is a release he had at the beginning of the year before they changed his base to a brissett base uh i mean the release is good the movement is looking really good the uh, everything's looking really good on this card he's gonna be one of the best defensive cards in the game while he doesn't quite have the release of a Kawhi, in my opinion at the small forward position he's going to be the second or third best small forward in the game i think there's an argument to be made that he's better than Kawhi because of the playmaking and because of the interior defense and the size he is going to be an absolute dog though that i have no doubt of let's hop into a game see what andre karolinko can do all right, going up against D. Mitch, D. Book, Kawhi, AD, and Tim Duncan. Kawhi at the three. Interested to see if he switches the matchup or if he leaves Kawhi on AK. Because if he leaves Kawhi on AK, not going to be a ton of shot creation stuff I can really do because Kawhi is one of the best defensive cards in the game, obviously. But with that being said, we're going to see what we can get into in this game. He is literally standing under the rim with Donovan Mitchell. Um, Interesting strategy, I guess. I'm kind of confused, actually, to be honest. Run around the screen here. Attack downhill. Hit our pop. Yo, AK, you were supposed to pop. I What a weird animation that was. Weird layup animation. I'm kind of surprised it didn't go in. I didn't time it properly, though. But that was just a really weird way to start the game, to be honest. Uh, and we give up a wide of a 3 to Devin Booker. Wow, that's really poor start to the game, to be honest. We get lucky that he misses it. Uh, pump fake here. We got D-Book on us this time on this possession. Attack and downhill. That's the type of defensive match matchup that we're really looking for. Now, we're going to go into the post. We got a mismatch. We're going to attack our mismatch and force him to help off of somebody he does help off of somebody it's magic not ak unfortunately but i'll take my bucket and we get ourselves one right there good burst by ak forced a switch created a mismatch got us a bucket ak was at the core of us getting that bucket there with his playmaking even though it may not have been the the most impressive like he, he wasn't the one who scored personally or anything good move by d book by the way really nice move there uh and we're gonna go pick and pop again same side burst i think this dude might be running a zone uh no he's not uh interesting he's he's really not not gonna make it easy on ak it doesn't seem like oh wow we just got him cooked into that screen goodness gracious nice time burst rejecting the screen tim or chris bosch set an awesome screen oh, we really cooked Kawhi there beautiful stuff nice three hunt from andre karolinko didn't expect to see a lot of that but that is something you love to see for sure uh let's put him on donovan mitchell what am i doing that defense was atrocious he hit the white but damn that defense was bad i'm not even gonna lie uh we're gonna go pick and roll here 
He'd be better. I think he's just going to help off Donovan Mitchell. He's not going to. Oh, my goodness. Look at Paul George. Absolute contact duck off of that screen. Gets downhill again. AK with three points and one run rebound is good enough for me so far. And now we got him on defense as well. I didn't have him on ball, which is a bad decision. I mean, look at AK just beating dudes up with the way the CPU AI defense is in this game right now. A card like AK is just so OD. It's going to be tough to match up against. Apologize if y'all can hear the background noise again. Yeah, by, by the way, uh, it's one of the things I just can't control about living in an apartment sometimes. Is sometimes you're going to have background noise and kind of is what it is. But uh, wall up on the inside. Yeah, because I definitely wanted to jump there. Well, at least we got our X switch and we got PG to guard him. Somebody he's going to try to uh, reject it. Yep. Good, 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 good. D board and no board, though. Uh, get back to guarding Timmy D. We're good. Good defense. Swing off of Donovan Mitchell. Now rotate with Bosch a little bit to help off down here. Play that. And amazing defensive possession. Really solid stuff right there on the defensive end. Let's go pick and pop again. We're going to go push cross here, and I just can't trigger the push cross right now. Uh, AK is going to same side burst and attack downhill. He is really moving very quick. I am shocked. Ka Kawhi shouldn't be stealing that. I'm not going to lie. Kawhi should not be stealing that. I... I have a problem with Kawhi stealing that ball. That's a CPU. Should not be stealing that. That kind of bothers me. I wasn't throwing it like a cross court into Kawhi's face or anything. I don't feel like that really should have been a steal. But mismatch here. People are going to, by the way, people are going to put their small guards on AK. He is going to, people are going to see him and see him as the biggest offensive liability on the court. And if he can't make that shot, I see why. He's not an offensive liability at all. But uh, I can see why somebody's wanting to do that. That that was a, I just feel like that should have been an easy make though I, I don't know how i'm missing that how that's a lightly or anything because donna mitchell is not very big uh contestant again he greens a heavy i can't shoot period apparently my opponent's green and heavies i golly this is, uh, okay cool even with the shooting patch occasional heavy might go in and i guess i can't be too mad about it but i'm just mad that my shots are always getting slowed down but then he shoots that shot and gets a gets three points out of it like that is just it just shouldn't be getting rewarded in my opinion but it is what it is um helping here ak recovering to the corner uh playing laterally in front of donna mitchell contest good d get through the screen he's back oh my gosh good defense andre kirilenko a mastermind of a defensive performance just completely sh yeah dude <laughs> are you kidding i can't shoot the ball period i haven't been able to shoot the ball for a week but he's hitting that like what am i watching right now He's now green two awful shots with Devin Booker. Like, pre-patch type shots. The, the, what is that? Literally, what is that? I, I don't know what you want me to do there. Um, back out to Bosch. Good pass. Catch and shoot. Bosch, I need this three. Thank you for greening that. That's a big shot. Gets us back into it. That's really bad, though. I do not like that at all. I'm going to X-switch uh, AK onto D-Book here. We're going to try to make him work. And then I'm X-switching any sort of screen. Um, send that. No, send. Okay, didn't send a double. That's fine um send a double please thank you rotate and double good defense run the floor stop on the break boss stretch i need it let's go we're knocking down shots with Bosch. huge clutch three in transition to tie up the game that's a great double team we got a strip and we got the ball back and now ak is going to be up on all up on that d book junk yes sir we're contesting if he hits another i don't know what y'all want me to do i don't know what y'all want me to do Shooting's been broken for a week, but apparently this dude doesn't get any sort of slowdowns. Can green every heavy. I've played elite defense this whole game, and apparently Devin Booker is still broken. He's either This dude either has a zen, they've either patched shooting this morning and not told anybody, and now you can shoot bad shots again, or the game's just bad. One of the three things. I, I don't know, but that's... Even if they patch shooting, that's ridiculous. He has now green two heavies and a horrible fading lightly this game, and he's going to win the game off of awful shot selection. That bothers me. Big time. Is there anything I can do about it? Not really, I don't think, but um, yeah, I don't know. It is what it is. Good defense here. We just bait the life out of this dude. Da attack here. He's going to... I just wanted to... It's okay. He's going to feel like a dog for that steal, but uh, there's not a lot I can really do about that. I want to win it with AK. I should have taken my dunk, but it is what it is. And uh, losing this dude, I only lost because he greened terrible shots. I, I don't know. AK with four points, one rebound, one assist. Made his one three. I thought he played fine. I needed him to make that last free throw, but I don't think it would have mattered. He played really good. I just, I don't know. If y'all can't tell, I am very displeased with the state of my team gameplay right now. 
That game with AK wasn't bad. I felt like he played fine. He played his role really well. We showed off some defense. He's just not a not a great shot creator. He did a little bit of it. He got a really nice three against Kawhi, but statistically not the most impressive game player or anything, and that's kind of normal. I thought we played fine as a team, and I thought we 100% deserved to win that game. It just created the worst shots in the world. I, I'm hoping they reverted shooting, and that's what it was, and that there's some ghost pass or shooting that tweaks stuff this morning because that would hopefully make the gameplay better, but I am having a miserable time on this game right now, and I apologize that it's hopefully... that it's probably impacting the way that I'm that y'all are enjoying these videos to a certain extent as well but it's just not fun to play right now and that the way that he just won that game just he scored eight points off of awful shots half his points were off of the worst shot selection in the world and he just got lucky I don't know it is what it is but hope y'all did enjoy this video AK is an amazing card he's probably the best lockdown defender in my team right now and I'll be back with more 2k content very very soon I appreciate y'all peace